Hi everyone, 12 News Meteorologist Stephen Matragrano here with a Weather Now update for you. This video as of about 12.30 in the afternoon, still a tornado watch in effect for Providence County. That's until 3 o'clock this afternoon. And uh, you can see that yellow shading there extends back into parts of Connecticut and Long Island and also parts of uh, Massachusetts up towards Worcester. So again, that's until 3 o'clock and for Providence County. Remember, a watch just means that conditions are favorable uh, for a potential tornado to develop, but uh, all signs so far have been pointing to that threat slowly decreasing through the afternoon, but of course we'll be keeping our eyes on that. And also, a flood watch remains in effect for all over Rhode Island and Bristol County in Massachusetts. That's that dark green shading. That's until 2 a.m. Monday, so that's until overnight tonight. And again, we still have lots of you know showers, downpours, and thunderstorms to get through as we go through the rest of our Sunday. So we're not out of the woods yet in terms of wet weather. And of course, any downpours could lead to those flooded areas. And uh, we've been seeing you know a lot of flooding the last few weeks. So it doesn't take much for um, you know more flooding to occur because the grounds are just so saturated. So here's a look at the radar. You can see all those reds and uh, darker shades that can bring us in closer here to Killingly, Killingly, Connecticut, up to Thompson. And you can see that along uh, 395 and also making its way into Burrowville and Chapachet and eventually making its way into the northern part of the state in like Woonsocket and Cumberland. So uh, that's where the heaviest rain is focused right now. Down along the coastline, though, it's been lighter rain, if not, you know, no rain at all. Um, you can see Newport's uh, in a dry spot and westerly uh, near some light rain. Uh, there is some more downpours, though, across uh, near the Twin Forks there of Long Island. But for the most part, again, uh, we're looking at those downpours being further north. Here's a wide view. Look at all the flash flood warnings in Connecticut, those green outline boxes. If you look closely, you can see them. And uh, that yellow shading is the tornado watch, by the way. So that's why it extends all the way up to New Hampshire and Maine. And again, for the rest of today, looking at those showers and downpours continuing uh, with a, a, you know flooding possible in spots, temperatures in the 70s, winds south about 5 to 10 miles per hour. Any storm could have some stronger gusts in them. Tonight's forecast, those showers and storms will be confined during the uh, evening hours, and I think we'll see some drier weather as we head into later on at night. So just again, be weather aware for this afternoon and evening. And of course, if any roads are flooded, do not go through them. Turn around, don't drown, and find an alternate route. We'll have more updates to come, though, through the rest of the afternoon and evening, so make sure you check back for those. Take care.